OMG, King Charles and Rishi made decision to revoke Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's titles today. Hello royal friends, good to see you all here again. Here's your regular dose of royal news and analysis. Before we move on to any other details, I really want to thank you for all your immense love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, well, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button now and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's behavior after leaving the royal family has led to repeated requests for the king to revoke their titles. Amidst increasing pressure, King Charles III remains steadfast in her decision to preserve the titles bestowed on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, rejecting any intention to strip them to avoid humiliation for the son. Royal expert Rebecca English sheds light on the monarch's stance, revealing that Charles absolutely maintained the original titles bestowed upon him by Queen Elizabeth in a gesture of respect. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex, Harry and Meghan, have been the subject of intense scrutiny following their departure from official royal duties, marked by sustained criticism of the royal family. Calls for intervention have escalated, urging King Charles III to reconsider book titles in the wake of the pair's persistent allegations, especially in the wake of Omid Scobie's latest book, and Game. Despite the growing pressure, expert sources close to the royal family insist that Charles is unlikely to resort to such drastic measures. Rebecca English, speaking on the matter, emphasized the king's reluctance and declared that he would never strip them of their titles, never, ever, ever. The titles were originally given to Harry by the queen herself on the occasion of his wedding, and Charles, out of respect for the queen, did not want to carry out such punitive actions. However, the debate surrounding titles is not limited to the royal corridors. Members of Parliament, Bob Seeley, took a proactive stance by proposing an amendment to the expedite the process of stripping Harry and Meghan of their titles. Seeley aimed to introduce the bill potentially bypassing normal parliamentary procedures, a move that has been met with both determination and skepticism. Rebecca English acknowledged Seeley's efforts, saying that a backbench MP intends to introduce a bill to Parliament to consider stripping the Sussexes of their titles. However, she also noted the historical challenges that such bills face and warned that success often lies within the existing legal framework. King Charles III can only revoke his titles enough through an act of parliament, Prince Harry. In addition to the title, Duke of Sussex was also bestowed the titles Earl of Dumbarton and Baroness Keel as Meghan adopted the feminine forms of these titles. The royal saga unfolded. The preservation of the title remains a controversial issue, symbolizing the delicate balance between tradition and family ties. So what do you think about this news? Will King Charles III's decision to retain Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's titles affect public perception of the royal family, and how might this decision shape the future image of the monarchy? Drop a comment, let us know what you think. Until then, we'll just have to wait and see if things end up like we thought. Also, if you ever never want to miss out on any of these hot royal updates, subscribe and press the bell icon. It's really as simple as that. So until next time, hasta la vista.